Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, Winoli, and welcome to Talion. Found this game on Google Play. I was gonna play it like way back then, but I, the phone that I was using already had like a whole bunch of data, and this thing took two gigs. I already had like two gig games on my phone that I didn't want to uninstall and have to install back. But like, yeah, we're gonna be trying it out, seeing how it is. Let's go. So let me guess, they woke up again. Those who were brought to them by the hand of fate drank the blood of the guardian dragons and became their avatars. Why, why would they blink, drink dragon blood now? What? Fuck it. <laughs> I don't think I want to know anymore. I like this guy's helmet the most. I'm going over here. Yeah, his helmet looks way sicker. Don't like the shoulder pads though. Shoulders really throw me off. Everything else is pretty awesome. Just the shoulders. Okay, so it looks like we have a warrior class. Assassin. I'm guessing a priest or a mage. It looks like a mage. And we have a gunslinger. Which you just already sold me <laughs> all you needed to say was gunslinger and I will not be rocking that ponytail I'm good what other hairstyles you got <laughs> why are there so many ponytails dear god you know what so are they all just recolored is that is that what I'm getting out of here I guess that's something I'm going to have to work with. <laughs> sure, why not? Oh wait, that was preset? Duh. Oh well, they're still pretty much the same anyway, so. <laughs> I do not like those eyes. I guess I'll just go with that. Alright, so it seems like they got some customization here. I'm gonna have to turn this up a little bit. Just a tad, there we go. I don't think I'm gonna go like totally in depth though. I'm about to say, I wanna kinda widen your eyes a little bit. I was gonna say insert joke here, but you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna stop that. <laughs> if I get demonetized, <laughs> they don't have coloring. Huh? Weird. I didn't see coloring. Really don't care about makeup. So that's just like body size. So I'm guessing the game is gender lock, unfortunately. Which sucks to see. Really not a huge fan of gender lock games, that's for sure. Alright, let's go ahead and get started. It seems like you only have one per class as well. The 
I figured I'd skip that. that. That's too much lag. I don't know why, but mostly every game that I play on phone or on emulator lags like hell when they do that type of animation. And I never got why. Oh yeah, they're having like a Ultraman event as well, like collab. Which actually looked pretty sick. I wanted to try it out too. Ooh, free stuff. Okay. Let's go talk to them. The Rai are attacking us. They don't, they don't look so tough. Look at them. Okay, so these are automatically equipped. If I remember correctly, I've used something like this. Yeah, so each attack pretty much increases your damage. Yeah, I've used something similar to like that in the game. Alright, they have the classic auto battle too. Dude, our portrait even looks like our character. That's, that's a few things I like to see. Having your portraits look exactly like your character. Huh. Okay, I'm gonna change something. I'm gonna actually put in my um, pad, my movement pad, so I can actually move around with my keyboard and mouse. There's something I don't really do, like, too often, but definitely should be doing now. <laughs> Probably not the most accurate, but you know, it works. Okay, so that's my normal attack, that's my dodge, and that is one of my skills. All right, let's go see some more gameplay. So, Blessing. Okay, I'm guessing that's actual currency and stuff like that. Damn. Dude, with how fast they're moving, I thought they were like Ninja Gaiden characters front of back. That one badass comes in and just saves the day. Just carries the whole team. Pretty much shows up late <laughs> before everybody dies. The Ryer, swarming outpost number one. Sounds unfortunate. So you move around by holding two. So what's this? I, I wanted to go in there and look at that, but alright. Oh no, what do we do? We're going to jail? <laughs> I guess I'll look at the animations at least. I just want to see how much gameplay we can actually get into this video. My man looked like he's seen some things. It must be that group of people over there. Ah, uh, you mean that one person over here? Costumes? There's events. Oh, there's level up events too. That's bright.
Okay, so they had the whole reward claims. Seems like a typical Gameville style of rewards. If I can, I want to turn down the graphics. And that's for sure. Options. Yeah, don't auto set that. Please go back to medium. Consume a hundred. Oh, well, I don't even think I consumed anything. What the hell? Okay, so I'm guessing it's instant base too. I guess we'll find out. Chapter one. They even have a um, combat power, which Gameville loves using. You know, I was gonna make a short, thick waifu, but until it was gender locked, and I'm sad. Here, you can view and manage items. Ooh, armor. Wait, do we already have it equipped? I almost push I to try and open this thing. <laughs> Need to remember that I'm on the emulator. Okay, I had that equipped, so I'm guessing we're getting the armor after this. Oh, well, you know. <laughs> Just come back and kill a lot of things. The guy looks like he has something really important. What's the matter? Outpost 2 has been attacked. No way. We don't have enough numbers here to support them. Don't worry. I'll take care of them myself. Then who's gonna take care of Fort One? Help us one needs you too. What if they come back? Whoops, dropping things. <laughs> How the hell did they even get in here with that little magical wall? Oh, even our outfit changes during the... During like the whole chats and everything. That's pretty cool. So even our, our portrait just basically overall changes depending on our character's design. I like that. Not something you see like most MMOs do these days anyway. Or, actually, this is the first time I've ever seen an MMO do that. Like, normally they would just, you know, just show the 3D model. They would never do, like, portraits like that. I guess that's exclusive for um, MMOs. Okay, I kind of like that hairstyle. I'll, I'll keep it. Dude, some girls look hot with that, too. I won't even lie, I lean more to the punk rock side, too. Why am I telling you guys my preferences? What? <laughs> even though there's more to that preference. I don't discriminate. Okay, now I don't like that hairstyle very much. Now that I'm actually looking at it. <laughs> Not for this character. Yeah, I still remember how to do that with Mouse. It's annoying and tedious to do it with mouse, but still. I still don't get how how the hell are mobile mobile games outdoing actual games right now, man. <laughs> like it just seems like mobile devs have more of a passion. And actual PC devs. 
Like, we haven't gotten a really good MMO in, like, a long ass time. And I played multiple MMOs. I played a lot. But it's been a long time since we've gotten, like, an actual good one. And one that I've stuck with. Is my guy over here <laughs> mobbing? First time I've ever seen an NPC gather up enemies into a mob. <laughs> oh, okay. So I guess that's how death works. <laughs> so, good thing, good thing I know if I die, the earth is going to take me. Wait, I'm so confused. What did, what did we just do? Okay. Okay, so it's on a cooldown once you evade once. So I'm pretty sure you can pick the skills as he fights too. I'm Alex, a scout from the Wolf Knights. Ooh, a necklace. To be honest, there aren't many MMOs I thought about getting back into. Well actually Grand Fantasia has always been fun. I used to like Twin Saga, but eh, it's just not for me anymore. You know, it's like one of those really easy MMOs that takes a while to get used to. I don't know, X Legend just has me for a while, but then it's just like, after a bit they lose me. But normally they have me for at least like a year though, that's for sure. I don't think they had me that long. That was funny. I actually thought about watching the anime Ultraman. I thought about it. Never got around to it. Why are you doing that? I'm going to go in here. So that stuff we have equipped. We got skills over here that we can upgrade. Let's say where are my skill points? Oh, here they are. I'm going to go for the four up in the front, just for easier clearing. There's a ruby shop. Oh, that's cool. You got equipment summons, so it still has the gotcha elements in a way. Opening missions. But is it actually bloody? Let me go see. Also, does this game have mounts? That's another question. Well, it's not all that bloody. You lied to me. Well, it's about to be in a few seconds, apparently. Damn! Alright. Keep that badass. He's the most badass one. Was that the bloody gate we're talking about? Dude. Start running. Why, why are you staring? Oh, well. Feels bad, mate. See, I would've took off already. over like what the fuck
Yeah, clearly the most badass out of your whole squad. And he's probably gonna die later. It's like, ow, flesh wound. I'm gonna have to go back home and heal this now. You fuck. <laughs> Clearly, he had the high ground. Ooh, free stuff. Tap the back button in the character menu. You can acquire materials by dismantling unused items. Try tapping dismantle now. Okay. Let's shoot them together, guy. Yeah, we're copying each other's skills. Oh no. <laughs> we're all in sync. When the squad, when the squad rolls up. <laughs> what the hell's this? Oh, dungeon clear tickets. Investigate the bloody gates. I got you, my guy. I can still sense an evil aura from the bloody gate. Oh god, no, it's a farming mission. So basically, we're still doing the old classic farming mission for an item drop. So basically, you'll fight a mob until they drop a certain item. Oh god, I, I hated those. Hey, sorry, dude. You're gonna have to you're gonna have to get those quest drops, my guy. I dude, that that used to be like really annoying. <laughs> Because I remember flashbacks of trying to like grind for an item for a whole day and never got that item. Dude, is your arm supposed to be injured? Your world doesn't look all that different, to be honest. Or did you just teleport? Is that what I'm getting at here? Oh, I pushed the wrong button instead of dodge. <laughs> I was over here pushing jump. Fire element. Enhances rides. So I'm guessing we get mounts. Mounts sound like fun. Oh, like of rewards. Become Ultraman. What else is in this? I mean, that guy looks pretty cool. Rewards. Collect energy to help Ultraman. These are fragments, right? So I'm guessing we collect those fragments to create Ultraman? Oh, this is the Ace suit. That's neat, I guess. Defeat who? Oh, we already finished that mission. Never mind. When you forget the demon you you killed. Like been taken care of. But demons forget humans that they killed. Or don't even bother to ask their name, you know? So it's only fair. Tap the skill 
button in the character menu. You can enhance skills here. Yeah, I know. Skill points are we must get rid of the rest of the rye. Also, why are they call it rye? Did one of them tell you their name or what they are? Oh, that seals kind of dope, just for clearing. Okay, they're behind me. Oh, I thought they were going to attack me. <laughs> no, not the bloody gate. Alright, so, so far, how I feel about this game is definitely not for me. I don't just feel it hooking me to play it, unfortunately. Appearance ticket. Wait, what? So I'm guessing that's just literally the normal shop. This is basic, basic stuff, though. Let's see what we get. Uh, hair. <laughs> oh my god. Boots. Yeah, they. Alright, let's do the 10 summon. Well, the basically the 11 summon. How oh, nice. Bag. I'm trying not to sneeze right now. I'm really trying not to. What the hell is this thing? Oh, this is a ride. So that's a mount, huh? Oh, okay, so they also give you like little packs that go into your uh, inventory too. Noted. Apparently this gun outdoes our rest of our guns. Let's see. Can we not compare or anything, my guy? We're not gonna side-by-side -side compare? That's weird. Gameville normally does that. Oh, this hair is just way stronger, apparently. Looks way nice, too. Way, way nice. Okay, let's see, look at somebody's design. Nah, eh, not feeling that one. Man, eh, kind of feeling that one, a little bit. But what does this one look like? Reminds me of, like, something you'll see in Prince of Persia. But I like this one a lot more. Ah, that one looks so much cooler, though. I want this. <laughs> God damn it. Fine, I'll just take the hair. Wait, can you do, like, cosmetics? But you can't put anything as cosmetics? Like, design? I feel like I've been bamboozled. Because I don't like the look of that. I want this one. I'm sad now. Uh, Jess has basically told me to go fuck myself and just use the one we give. I would never be a gunslinger with that. I would hate my life. I wouldn't even use that as a gunslinger. But apparently it's the best weapon I have. That's weird, but yeah. Maybe there is a way to wear this. Is it... Oh, it definitely wouldn't be share. That's pretty much the yeah, chat announcements. 
Hmm. I still don't get why it doesn't have that. Especially in an appearance heavy game like this. Is it the ticket that does it? Let me guess, just basically redesign yourself if you don't like it? Oh yeah, basically. I don't know how I feel about that. Not a huge fan of that. Because I'm kind of sad that we can't do the whole, you know, look good while fighting. Fashion is something that a lot of players care about, too. <laughs> yeah, we care about stats, but we also care about making our character look fucking epic. Let's say these guys really don't attack us unless we attack them. So I'm guessing that's going to be through the whole game, or is there aggressive enemies? Because normally we would see red over their heads if they're aggressive, like you know, normal MMO logic. It's cool that they got voice acting though. That's at least neat. But yeah guys, we're gonna end it off here. So yeah, it's pretty neat game. That's for sure. And this guy already has the Ultraman suit. Look at him. <laughs> just the game's just not for me, personally. It's pretty cool, though. Pretty cool. Glad to see that these games are still expanding, you know? Most, most like, MMO games definitely don't look like this. Kind of reminds me of Black Desert, in a way, to be honest. That's for sure. I don't know why it reminds me of Black Desert, but who knows. But I will see you guys on the next one. Until then, peace out.